this is Christian from Port Charlotte MMA Sportswear and I want to introduce you the newest member of our fight team, Todd Duffy. Excellent, Todd. So, so Portland, Oregon, set the scene for us. What happened? I went out. I was expecting a three-round war with Tim Hague, and I, I guess got a little lucky in, in seven seconds. So. Seven seconds. I mean, did you ever expect even to come close to? Uh, you were gonna win, right? No, I definitely expected to win. I didn't expect it to go down the way it did. Um, it definitely, you know, I fought a year. I was looking for a war. I can't lie. Uh, I was happy with it when I thought I was getting a KO and knock out and I had a bonus, but it was still worth it. Everything turned out well. So you kind of want to go in, you kind of didn't want it to be over, so you just get in the ring, seven wanted seconds, fight. Yeah, you wanted to have fight. a fight. Yeah. So, um, uh, what, what was the look in his eyes? I mean, what was his reaction? Did you see? Before or uh, during? Well, I was like, during, during, like that, that uh, moment. He hit the mat and I couldn't see his face initially and I didn't. I thought he fell, um, honestly, from the angle of his hook. And then when I, he got on top of him, I was going to throw two big bombs and settle down, settle in his guard, or probably half guard to what it would end up being. Um, he, he turns back and goes, oh shit, and I realized that he just woke back up and I needed to go ahead and try to finish him and I came back across that left, that, that left and landed flush and I knew it was over. That's amazing. So are you going to go for seven seconds next time? What's the next fight? Uh, next fight, I haven't got a chance to talk to Dana or Joe about anything like that. Um, hopefully the sooner the better, man. I really like to get some fights and the biggest problem I've had in my career is just getting consistency in my fight schedule. Not because I didn't want to or wasn't training, it's just fights fall out, things like that, heavyweight divisions. Not yeah. a lot of guys there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looking to fight, I guess. So, uh, and 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 crowd reaction. Tell me about that when you didn't hear it, man. I I usually I'm in there. I'm in there. Uh, the first thing I did after I won was I looked for my corner. Had trouble finding them. Um, of course, you gotta you know say some stuff to the people back home. Sure. To the camera. Gave my corner a hug. Uh, yelled some silliness into the camera, and that's about it, man. Uh, you know the crowd reaction after I got out of the cage was awesome. You know uh, people. You know people were very receptive. Got a lot of handshakes. Got a lot of pictures. Got a lot of high fives, man. Um, it's hard, but as far as while I was in there, I don't. I'm not even there. That, yeah. You know, I'm, I'm in the cage. That's, that's yeah, 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 yeah. Right You're in the cage. So right, right. The I don't, in the cage. I don't hear or even see the crowd. So how about people behind Born Stronger, man? Tell us about Born Stronger. I really, I really like, you know, I like where they're taking things. Um, I like, you know, I like their, their motto. I like everything about it, man. It's kind of, kind of what I, I feel like I embody as, as a person. Excellent, excellent. Todd, great. Congratulations and, and good luck. Christian, anything you want to add? Thank you very much and congratulations. Thank you, man. Thank you. Okay, thanks, Todd.